Nearly 20 additional cases connected to a corrupt Chicago police sergeant will be tossed out this morning. Prosecutors say the rogue cop and his team planted drugs on men from the south side for years. CBS 2's Lauren Victory live at the Layton Criminal Courthouse with more on this mass exoneration. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning, Marissa and Aaron. This will mark the second time in just a year that convictions will be overturned here, all linked to the same sergeant, and those might continue. That's because defense attorneys say former Sergeant Ronald Watts was involved in more than 500 convictions during his tenure with the Chicago Police Department. He was sent to prison for stealing money from a drug dealer who was actually working with the FBI four years ago. Last November, the records of 15 men tied to Watts's wrongdoing were cleared today. 18 more people who say Watts and his team planted drugs on them and or falsely arrested them will see their cases tossed. For many, though, it's a little too late. Today's framed victims served a combined total of 46 years plus time on probation. CBS 2's Roseanne Teyes spoke to a man exonerated last time around who spent five years behind bars after what he calls a bogus arrest. How angry are you about losing that time? I am angry. I'm frustrated. They planted 100 bags of heroin and 90 bags of crack cocaine on me. Now, those arrests expected to be thrown out today would bring the grand total of people exonerated and linked to this sergeant to 42. Some of the hopefully newly cleared men are expected to speak after this morning's brief court hearing at 930. I'm Laura Victor reporting live at the Leighton Criminal Courthouse. CBS 2 News, Marissa. All right, Lauren, thank you.